Hi friends, welcome to my channel, Basic Engineering. Today we will discuss about line inclined to both the planes. Top we have a 75 mm long line CD measures 50 mm. End C is in HP and 50 mm in front of VP. End D is 15 mm in front of VP and it is above HP. Draw projections of CD and find angle with HP and VP. They given 75 mm length, the two length. The top view of this line is 50 mm. NC is in the HP and 50 mm in front of VP. ND is 15 mm in front of VP and above HP. They don't give an above distance. Draw projections of CD and find the angle with the HP and VP. And we have to find the theta, we have to find the phi. First you draw the XY line of any length. Next you draw a vertical line. On this line we have to indicate the projections of C. And we have to indicate C dash and C. C in the HP that means C dash comes on the XY line here. Like this. Now C is 50 mm in front of VP. We look at the point at a distance of 50 mm like this. And name this point as C. Now draw a argent line through C of any length. Now you have to look at the ND. ND is 15 mm in front of VP. At a distance of 50 mm from XY. From XY at a distance of 15 mm draw a argent line like this. The distance between the two these two lines is the 15 mm. The distance between these two mm lines is the 15 mm. The given top view length is 50 mm. To take 50 mm as the radius, C as center. Draw arc on this line. Like this. We take 50 mm as the radius. C as center. Draw an arc on this line. And name it as D. Like this. Now join the C and D. This is our required top view. Of length 50 mm. Now similarly you take full length 7 mm. Now you take 7 mm as the radius. C as center. Cut the arc on this line. Like this. And name it as D2 dash. Now join C and D2. This is our two length. 7 mm. Now we draw a vertical line from D. Like this. Now you take the vertical line from D2 up to C dash line. From D to the C dash line. Like this. Now name it as D2 dash. Now you take C dash D2 dash as radius. C dash as center. Draw arc like this. You take C dash as center. C to D to dash as radius. Draw an arc from this line to this line. And name it as D dash. Now draw the locus line at D dash. Now join the C dash and D dash. This is our required front view. Now similarly, you take 75 radius. C dash as center. Cut this locus line. And name it as D1 dash. Now join C dash and D1 dash. This is our required two length. Now, you take this angle as theta. Measure this angle, theta. And this angle as, let's see, this angle as phi. The two length making with the origin line is phi. Like this, you can find the angles with H and V. They are asking this only, theta and phi. Thank you for watching my video.